All right, today we're actually going to be cooking Hawaiian North Shore garlic shrimp, legend style. And what legend style means is that uh, when I get done putting out 120 decoys, the last thing I want to do is fight to get these shells off the shrimp when I get back. In Hawaii, they actually cook them with the shells on them, but we're not going to do that here today because I don't want to fight my shells. Use a cup of flour, there. and in the flour you mix two uh, tablespoons of paprika and a half a tablespoon of cayenne pepper. And the paprika adds color and the cayenne pepper adds the heat. I might even do a tablespoon of cayenne pepper because I like it. Also, you can't have anything without slap your mama. We love slap your mama. We put it in everything. And we're also looking about a half a cup of butter and approximately 10 cloves of chopped garlic. Um, we love garlic, so that'll be awesome for us. We're going to actually devein the shrimp and we're going to uh, deshell them and then we're going to dredge them in the flour and put them in the hot butter with garlic. We'll be right back. All right, we're going to turn our stove on about medium high and get the pan coming up to temperature. You'll never want to put it in the cold pan. All right, we're going to put our butter and our 10 cloves, cloves of uh, garlic. And bring those up to heat. Listen to that sizzle. This is going to be so, so good. You do not want to burn the garlic though. Do not burn the garlic. I can't say that enough. Do not burn the garlic. Put that heat up and we'll put our shrimp in and it'll be cooking away. I went ahead and put uh, one tablespoon of cayenne pepper and two tablespoons of paprika and one cup of flour. And we're going to mix all those up. And then we're going to dredge our shrimp in it. Like I said, in Hawaii, they actually leave the shells on. But after I have to chase cripples all over the field that my buddies seem to uh, give me all the time, I do not feel like taking shells off of shrimp, so I just want to come home and I want to eat. And I don't want to fight for my food, so this is the best way we have found to do it. And then we put a little slap your mama in there, because we always love slap your mama. That is some good stuff, you have to try that. Everything is good with slap your mama, including eggs in the morning, or stews, or whatever. It's awesome. Okay, now we're going to start dredging our shrimp. Dredge our shrimp now. Just get an even coat on it. Let's, call it, let's do lazy man dredging here. I don't like easy stuff. I don't like fancy stuff. Okay. This is southern style cooking. Put everything in and just make it work. Shrimp is ready. Let's go in the butter. The butter is sizzling. Even coated everything. Everything looks good. We're ready to go to the pan. All in at one time. You kind of do a couple batches. And we usually let it cook about three minutes on one side and then get the other side. So we're going to let it cook for a few minutes here. A few minutes and we're actually going to flip them and uh, make sure you do this. You do not want to overcook shrimp and you definitely do not want to burn the garlic as I've told you before. It will cause it to be very bitter and you do not want bitter shrimp. Look at that color. I hope Camera Hottie is not around anytime soon. I'm going to taste some of these and hide some so she can't get them all. All right, we turn them out to three minutes. Look how golden brown they're getting. They're just looking delicious. Can't wait to eat this tonight. A little bread. In Hawaii, they actually use rice, a lemon wedge, and bread, but uh, 
I don't need the rice. I'll just stick with the bread. We're actually going to take them out, and we're going to start the next batch. And then when both batches are done, we're going to mix them back together. We're going to put a little uh, cooking wine with them. Deglaze the plant pan. And a little lemon juice, which we actually used half a lemon. It's going to be outstanding. This is the kind of food we love to eat while we're on the road. It's awesome stuff. And then we're going to hit it with a little bit of cooking wine and some lemon juice. And we're just going to bring it up to a boil real quick and then everything will be ready to eat. It's going to be awesome. Look at the color on that. It's just incredible. This is one of my favorite dishes right here. Look at all that garlic. I don't think we're going to have any problem with the vampires over here tonight, that's for sure. Little bread, that is awesome. Oh my god, you got to try this. www.waterfowllegends.com Check us out, we got the best calls on the market and some of the best videos coming out. Talk to you soon.